My name is Kate Cheney Chapel. I was born in Hartford, Connecticut in 1945. And I first came to Monhegan in the late 80s, early 90s on a, a sense of my destiny as an artist to find that community of artists on the island and uh, be part of it. Monhegan is a soul place for me, and I think for many people. Uh, for me, it was a place I felt I came into myself, that I had an idea that I wanted to grow into being a more full-time professional artist. The essence of who I am is when I'm on the rock painting on the island. I'm just there and nothing is interfering with my connection to what's very hard to describe as all of us struggle to describe the mystery or the spirit or some people call it God, a connection within yourself but also coming from that experience of being particularly in nature I think. I like to work in a lot of different mediums. I was trained originally as a, a painter and printmaker. I studied in Paris as well as in colleges in the States. But really all of my work comes from a place of being concerned about the natural world, about the depredations of humans on the natural world. and awaking people to that interference and that um, that they're part of the web of life and if they do, whatever they do to the earth they do to themselves because it's all of a piece and uh, so I I want my work to reflect that unity I would say when I was five six and seven if anyone asked me I would say well I'm going to be an artist and uh, indeed I have, but it's been a long journey. When I'm on Monhegan, I cannot help but go with, t put my gear into my little old ratty backpack and go down to um, Pebble Beach or out to the backside and just sit there and paint. And there's nothing like it. And, I started that way, so I come back to it. It's something I revisit every summer. There's something about the island that makes you feel more alive because you're right, you're on the edge of, this, of the sea. You're on the edge of our country, really. Um, and you're sometimes on the edge um, in terms of living, you realize. You're living there because um, the island allows you to. My work may take off in different directions during the rest of the year, but it's like an anchor. I, I can go back and be suddenly drawn into looking at um, a tide pool or a rock formation and noticing things because when you really are painting directly and you're in, in the open air, the plein air, you're actually into your painting goes, the sounds, the sights, the smells, and all of it. 